Hi, I'm Dean the Reading Machine, and today I'm reading Poor Louie. Um, so Louie um, had a great life. He had warm food that was smooth and he could eat. He was all by himself. He was all by himself. No babies, no older kids. Just his own, two owners, the mom and the dad. But then, they every night they had a movie, kiss goodnight, and went to sleep. But then, all of a sudden, when you were by yourself without Dylan? Do you remember? I had a happy life. I loved it. You loved it? And but then, were you, do you remember when Dylan came home for the first time? Do you remember Dylan when he was little? Yeah, I know. Um, and I, the, mommy, daddy, could I please have a baby brother? And they said, sure, we'll try to have one, mm. a baby brother. You did ask for one. But that was all my, that was what I want. I want to have that for my birthday wish. That was my birthday wish. That's right. And and I said my wish came true. It was a baby brother, and and you so said, your birthday wish came true. Yeah, and his birthday was. Let's start reading. Poor Luke. Oh, hello. You're probably wondering what I'm doing here in the dark by myself with all this stuff. If you guess that I tried to run away tonight, you're right. I did. Why? Well, that's a long story. I can tell you if you'd like. My name is Louie, by the way. Or it was. Now they just call me... Poor Louie. My life was great. Every morning started with a rock, rain or sunshine. On Sundays, on Sundays we would do fun things like like go for a stroll in the park, eat ice cream. Or go shopping. Pretty much every day of the week and in the same way. Dinner, movie, a kiss goodnight, and then off we went to sleep. Once in a while, Mom and I would have a play day with her friends. It was great. Everyone paid attention to me. But then one day they stared to, started to appear. First, there was one, just one, then two, then four. They pulled my ear, they squeezed my tummy. Mom! Poor Luby. Yeah, I know. They smell good. And they do walk on all four legs. But I give them that. But geez, all I could say was... Thank goodness, we never have one of those in our house. Yep, life was pretty perfect with just the three of us. Let me just tell you, things got weird. First, it was dinner, cold, on the floor. Poor Louie. I still had my walks, I guess, sort of. Bedtime wasn't fun at all. Packard. Pets on? Peter? Perfect. Over time, mommy's bell, mom's belly grew and grew and grew. Till one night, it kicked me. Boom. From that night on, I slept on the floor. Just me and my food dish. Things couldn't get Probably. Possibly. Possibly get worse, right? Wrong. 
One day, Mom and Dad came home with lots of new stuff. At first, it seemed okay. There were two beds, fun. Two hiking pouches, good. Can have enough of those. Two sweaters, cute. Two hats, okay. Wait a minute, what's that thing? Two seats, and that's when it hit me. Poor Louis. One of those creatures I could handle. But two, no way. When mom and dad just rushed off and left me all alone. No, I wouldn't even kiss goodbye. Well, that was the last straw. I got all of my things together and ran away forever. The coast was clear. I was on my way when... Louie, how did you get... How did... How did you get out? I must have left the door open. Your mom and dad will be home soon. Back you go. And that's it. The end. My life is over. You could close, you could close the book now. Thanks for listening. Lou, Louie, meet your baby brother, my baby brother, my baby brother. Poor Louie. The end. See you later, folks, and have a wonderful day. New videos every Saturday. Bye bye bye.